Y'all, I think I'm really starting to get addicted to like posting up on YouTube, dog. You dig? I just be wanting to get on here and talk to y'all, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all the people, man. I just be wanting to get on here and check in with y'all, see how y'all doing, man. I'm starting to really enjoy whatever whatever this is, man. I'm starting to really enjoy it. Now, one of the things that I'm not enjoying is when my videos don't get no goddamn views. It really, it really irks my nerves and it's very discouraging. But hey, I know that comes with being on the platform. Um, but I'm, and I'm getting introduced to a lot of like YouTube celebrities, not like face to face, but like just being in the space. I'm starting to like learn about the the many, you know, different YouTube personalities that exist and the people that came before them existed, and just you know how lucrative the space is. And now I understand why people do the shit that they do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I get why videos, these videos that you see going around, I understand it now. I didn't understand it before. Like, I understand it now. I get why people, you know, make the type of stuff that they make. You know, they need their content to be very inviting. They want their content to be very explosive. Um, it needs to be entertaining. It needs to retain your attention. But to what extent, dog? Like, are people not working regular jobs, dog? Like, it, it feels like they don't have regular jobs. Like, they no longer work anymore because I feel like they be in, like, fight or flight mode where they have to put together some type of content, you know what I'm saying, that's going to get viewed enough so that they can make money. You, you dig? So that means they doing a lot of strange things for a piece of change. They fabricating information, putting it out there. You know, they harassing people. They got this one chick. Um, I can't think of her name on YouTube, Daisy or whatever. She was going in stores and harassing people, taking stuff out their carts. You know what I'm saying? Like, bruh, you dig? And then uh, I know the other girl, she real popular. Um, little short black chick, she real popular, man. She be going around different neighborhoods, pranking people. You know what I'm saying? Like, all of that is crazy. Like, I'm from New Orleans, so, like, prank going wrong could be, you know what I'm saying, life ending. You know, like, man, we don't play like that, you dig? But a lot of people on YouTube doing little things like that to get views, you dig? Which I, which I think is very, very interesting seeing that a lot of the YouTubers that I noticed, like, I, I got put on Mr. Beast, right? Mr. Beast, um, he's the god of youtube pretty much not to compare him to god above god forgive me but you know what i'm saying he's it when well, you know he's him on youtube <clears throat> he's the biggest youtuber on the platform and one of the things that i noticed about his content dog is that he always makes sure he's posting and sharing contents that's gonna always gain sponsorships you know what i'm saying that's what your money gonna come in so nobody's sponsoring or correct me if i'm, if I'm wrong but who wants to sponsor a video where you're harassing people, where you're, you know what I'm saying, you've been a nuisance to the community, you know, like, what sponsor wants to attach themselves to you? You feel me? Like, YouTube, I guess the YouTube money must be really good, too, apparently, because you're not getting those sponsorships doing that at all. I don't see it, you know. I don't see a sponsor wanting to sponsor you going into walmart pretending to break items pretending to you know uh take people's stuff out of their carts um you know just harassing people so yeah <clears throat> it's crazy the things that people doing for money dog you know um it's more lucrative to post or share family content you know trying to be funny like the stuff that they think they doing is funny it ain't funny dog at all it, it ain't funny at all you know what i'm saying so i'm just getting introduced to the space and all the, the the variety of different types of content man trying to model my channel after somebody's channel you know and kind of making my own things just trying to see how they fluctuate their content and how far left they go how far right they go just learning you know as i go um obviously man i really enjoy being creative man you see a lot of the shorts that i do is always some you know that's potentially funny um you know what i'm saying just having a good time 
Um, I definitely like to pull up and pull a mic out and get on the mic, you know what I'm saying? Pause and, you know, post something, <clears throat> talk about something. But I'm also learning that I got to be consistent, you know what I'm saying? The subscribers that are subscribing because of the shorts <clears throat> are mainly subscribing because, you know, I be on some goofy you know what I'm saying? Some goofiness. You know what I'm saying? So that's what they want to see. So understanding how that all works. But man, I just want to get on here and chop it up with y'all, man. Like I said, I'm really enjoying being in the space, really getting on here and having a conversation, man. You know, breaking out of my shell, so to speak, and talking to y'all. Um, it's really cool, man. I'm hoping I can be um, more a part of the community, um, staying away from anything negative, man. Even though there's a lot to talk about. You know, you got all the stuff going on with p diddy uh td jakes charleston white um i'm trying to stay away from all of that man you know all of that if you talking about that that type of stuff you know what i'm saying in in a certain manner i guess you know it's gonna be hard to get sponsorships it's gonna be hard you know if you type in charleston white at all your ad stability gets questioned at all if you just type in charleston white in the title ad stability will get limited <laughs> and if you monetize on the channel man y'all know where i'm coming from y'all know what i'm talking about you know so you got to be really careful and i just think that depending on you know what you're in the space for um you know if you news media type thing you know going on with, with your channel then yeah you want to talk about all of that all of that stuff, you know. Um, but, man, look. If you got a funny bone in you, man, it's more lucrative to have a good time. You know, be respectful. Respect other people. Respect their space. And have a good time, man. My biggest challenge right now is the fact that I don't have a space where I could actually record for you guys. And, you know, it takes a long time and it takes a while for me to put together content to share with folks. You know what I'm saying? Um you know man i'm not really that funny you feel me um i just enjoy posting content man i enjoy being creative um i enjoy being inspired by other youtubers who out here you know posting content and looking at their type of creativity you know is very inspiring so man i'm just enjoying myself on the space man you know in the space you know um, I love seeing the subscriber count go up, man, you know, so if you're watching this video in its entirety, man, y'all go ahead and subscribe, man, go check out the videos, you know, the shorts for sure, um, you know, I started my channel talking about sports, um, I'm a big Kobe Bryant fan, and I'm, you know, a LeBron hater, you know what I'm saying, so, Y'all know how that go, man. So I spent a lot of time debunking certain narratives about the conversation and the topic of the GOAT um, and who's the GOAT and why this one not the GOAT. But, man, that shit fell flat because it's all opinionated, man. So I moved away from that. And, man, I just been having a good time, man. A lot of the content that y'all see me post and upload, um, that's me on a daily basis. You know what I'm saying? That's me on a daily basis, man, just having a good time, trying to make time go by. And I'm um, trying to enjoy life in the meantime, you know, um, bills daily, you know what I'm saying, working daily. You got to find some time for laughter, man. So y'all go check out the shorts, man. Go check out a lot of the shorts, bro. Um, and y'all let me know what type of content y'all enjoy, man. You know, like the stuff that I'm posting, you know, man, let me know if that's something that y'all enjoy, you know. And also let me know the things that y'all feel like, nah, man, stay away from that. You know what I'm saying? That ain't for you, you know. That'll help a brother out, man. You dig? Ultimately... I'm enjoying making the content, man, you know, trying to get my son to be a little bit more involved. Um, you know, he got his channel, man. Y'all go check out his YouTube channel at Price the Creator. You know what I'm saying? On YouTube, man, he do a lot of gaming on his channel. Trying to, you know, flood his channel with some subscribers and likes, man. Go check out the kid. You dig? If, I, if he would just listen to me, he will be a lot more entertaining. But, hey, y'all know how that go, man. Um, so, yeah, man, that's what's going on, man. 2024 man i'm hoping 2024 is the year um to get out of debt the year to you know hopefully grow my channel more um and do a lot of other things that i want to do man so thank you guys for checking out the channel man please subscribe bro y'all go check out the shorts like i said um let me know what y'all thoughts are man so i can you know kind of take that input and 
you know what I'm saying? Make something happen, man. So, till next time, bro, this your boy Joe. Joe Squad. Y'all already know what it is. I'm out.